Hey, Snack Pack, Snacking here, or putting the fruity in your pebbles, if you know what I mean. Bringing you a tactical breakdown on... Where the hell are we? Uh, Lee Jong. It's, uh, this was placement eight. Placement game number eight of our, uh, of our series. Um, we had a loss win, loss win, loss win thing going. Um, and then for some reason... Game eight, which had, would have been a win, ended up a loss uh, and broke the pattern. So we ended up at a uh, four to six uh, placement match. I placed uh, high silver, much to my chagrin. Um, I am holding, uh, even climbing a little. So, I mean, I'm I'm doing okay, but I still thought that we would do a. Uh, I still thought I'd do a little better than that um, since I wasn't healing. That being said, I will put up a recap later. Um, in the meantime, we're going to do this tactical breakdown and see what happened here on Li Zhang. Um, I blame bad egg rolls. Uh, we all partook. Puzzle pooped his armor. Um, cleaning out a mech, it wasn't it wasn't pretty. But that's another story. It's uh, me and Puzzle is the tanks. Um, Diva Reinhardt to start. Uh, Sadie is our Moira parrot is our uh, Anna. Electus is playing Tracer. Skips is playing McCree. Um, I think for an initial comp, this is fine. Um, the McCree... The McCree, I would say, does better at longer range, especially after his... Uh, not rework. His uh, 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 buff to his fall-off damage. Um, Tracer, I think, works good on just about any map, um, provided you can, you have the reflexes. And then Diva and Ryan, as I've said before, is my favorite tank duo. Um, I like Diva Ryan, Hammond Ryan, and, uh, uh, Monkey Ryan. And the reason is, is because the, you have the, the push, um, where you need to go. Whether your objective is a payload or a point. Uh, your Ryan can provide your push. He can give cover for the McCree and the Ana and the Moira. Um, I can go and handle flanking threats if I need to or uh, threats to the back line while Electus goes and harasses their back line. I think this is a good cop. Uh, so let's see what happened. That's very true. They have a lot of damage potential. When they go left, they'll tell you if they come this way. Okay, we're going right, I guess. Yep. Wait, oh, there's a bar. There. Yeah, good pick. All right, we're one and one. Um, Sadie took out one of their healers, and our tracer is down. So they're down a healer, we're down a DPS. All right, I'm out of position. You'll notice the rest of the team. The rest of the team is over here. And I'm over here getting my butt shot. So um, when the Pharah came in and booped the Ryan and I apart, um, I flanked around back thinking that it was... It was the right thing to do. Turned out to be a mistake because I'm just getting overwhelmed and going down here real quick. Um. <coughs> Got another one. Tracers okay. behind. We're down a tank. Pharah's on your left. I think we got it. Yeah. Ferris okay. going underneath. Ferris underneath? Okay. Yes. I don't think she was trying to. I think I just don't think she's as good as she thought. Okay, that is a move, right? Some fars are good enough to kind of hover between the death zone and the top of that the top of that pool. Um, this one wasn't. Yeah. 
Okay, that pulse bomb hurt. Um, both healers are down. We've got a DPS down. Um, they've brought in a brig. I didn't notice it before, but there's a Hanzo climbing up through the window. Um, we're in trouble, folks. Both your healers are down. Tracer, no recall. Um, yeah, I don't know. I, I don't know if every percent matters. Um, I think if Electus was already there, it makes sense to stall. Um, uh, although personally, if, if it was five on one and I had an escape route, I'd probably take it. Tracer, no recall. Okay, we took their brig. Their tracers doing tracer things. Sadie avoids. Okay, let's. Well, that was. As diva, when you hear Hanzo about to fire off his ult, get in his way with your deflector matrix up, and you have a good chance of taking out his ult completely, like I did just there. Yes, yes, I did. Oh yeah. Okay, we need to switch our comp. They've switched theirs. Um, it's been requested that we get a, a Mercy. Mercy Pharah is very powerful. Um, they've brought a Brig. We need something anti-Brig. Um, uh, Junkrat. Uh, we keep the Pharah something. Uh, McCree, if he can stun her. Or another Brig of our own. Just anything. To, uh, to counter that Brig. Reinhardt does counter Brig. Uh, maybe not directly, but a good Reinhardt can counter the Brig because he has more health and does more damage. Um, you know, but this one has backup and a Brig can duel anything. So we're about to lose both healers here. Okay, that was cheap. Just knock him off in the water. Okay, let's pause on the comps here. Let's think this through. So we've got Mercy, Ana. So Sadie did switch to support skips. Um, Parrot needs line of sight to heal. And that's going to be me and Reinhardt because Electus is off doing Tracer things. The problem that we've got, I think, this counters this. This counters this, mostly. This... Um, actually this, your Pharah, depending on how good he is, should be able to counter these 
here. And really even the Reinhardt. So the question mark is the Hanzo. Is the Hanzo good enough to kill the Pharah? Right. If he is, then our DPS are both countered, leaving extremely short range damage from the Reinhardt and the Diva, which means we have to brawl. If we have to brawl, this is going to shut us down. So, if our DPS are as countered as I think they are uh, by their comp, then our only chance is to go short range with me and Puzzle. And we will get we will get shut down on this deal. So, I think our comp is wrong to counter their comp. I think that's what's going on here. Maybe I'm wrong, but that's that's just what it looks like to me. That Tracer is doing an amazing job. An absolutely amazing job of shutting down our Mercy. Now, I didn't realize our Mercy was down. I didn't catch it. Their Rhine just went down, so I'm about to launch Diva Bomb, and I had already gone into it when our Rhine went down. This is a bad bomb. This was a bad decision on my part. I should have held the bomb and used it on the next push. Um, but it, it's too late now, so here we go. Okay, that was a uh, just a bad, bad, bad luck. Um, Electus got caught in a wild charge, uh, taking our Tracer down. It just happened to take down our Mercy, too. So we lost two players with one charge, um, making this, at best, five on four. Um, while I understand Electus's point, I, I do, because I play, you know, shit ton of Moira. Um, if the Moira is not DPSing, um, then the Moiras shouldn't have goldy limbs. So it depends on the Moira's play style. Yes, Moira can get a huge amount of a limbs just like Diva can and just like Winston can. Um, and... And the question is, what is Sadie's damage at this time, right? So has she been damaging a lot, or has she been healing a lot? Um, if she's been healing a lot and she has Goldie Limbs, we do have a problem. If she's been damaging a lot and has Goldie Limbs, that's probably right. So it depends on the Mortis playstyle. But looking at the comp, we are countered, right? We are obviously countered, because they... We had them for the first third of the of the match, and then they rolled us. They absolutely rolled us when they switched to the Brig, uh, kind of fair combination. They absolutely rolled us. And their their flankers were doing an amazingly good job of shutting down our healers. Oh, we have multiple problems. Um, I I do think the kills were low, but the uh, the biggest problem that I saw a couple problems is 
one, we're playing against a comp where we're countered. We should have dropped our tracer because um, the tracer is countered by the brig. Um, their tracer did a, an amazingly good job of shutting down our back line as well. And the enemy team got in some lucky shots to take our healers out. So they're focusing our healers down. We're not focusing their healers down. We don't have the support. We need to do our thing. Um, tank positioning, I don't know. Um, I think my tank positioning was weak. Uh, I know especially on that first play, it was bad. I made a bad decision on a bunny bomb. Um, it looked good at the time. When, when I hit the... When I hit Q, it looked good. It did not look good after after our Ryan went down. So I think we had, I think we had multiple problems, and I don't think we were finding the right solution. That being said, I'm switching to Winston here um, because I'm attempting to cover our back line. Let's see how that goes. Yeah, that's true. We weren't focus firing. Okay, I went wrecking ball because I just want to have some fun. I like the Reaper pick, honestly. I really like that Reaper pick. Now, what am I doing as Hammond? A couple of things here. Um, I can get some cheeky, some cheeky environmental kills. I can support our team um getting on and off of on and off a of point quickly um and but you'll notice i didn't just run in engage the enemy and run out because that the you absolutely can do that as hammond i don't and there are times that you should and there are times that you shouldn't and then you kind of got to feel that out i'm trying to support our right so i didn't want to just go in and risk being being killed especially if they still had that break Well, I couldn't save the Ana because uh, the brig can absolutely take her down and I can't do a damn thing about it. It's time for me to beat feet. I was trying to get out and couldn't couldn't swing it. No pun intended. Yeah, I saw yeah. Okay, sir. Nice. Did you guys all leave? What? Oh, yeah. Their car is in our phone. Fine. Both your healers are down. Keep healing. Both your healers are down. Oh, both are. Okay, I heard both there. Yeah, it's bad. Okay, we're getting rolled again. Um, their tracer is very, very good. And I've got the wrong tank. I need to change. Well, I forced the uh, I forced the ult. That Zen has my number, though. And now I've switched to Hammond. Or, sorry, not Hammond. From Hammond to Winston. Okay, they're going to engage on the rally. So let's see how this goes. Back up, let them in, let them in. Yeah, there's some payback. Where's 
Where's this Farah? Our split. I just I just went to peel for the right. Is she behind us? I'm not sure where she is. I should have jumped. Um, when I saw that Ryan get in charge position, I should have jumped, and I just I just went fast enough. Thank you for the res. It's all red. Yep. Enemy tracer has pulse bomb. That tracer really is good. Yep, that was unfortunate. Oh, that's nice. It's one and one. What about a rat? So, I I think it would came down to counterplay. There, I'm sure there were positional mistakes. Um, I'm sure there were engagement mistakes. But I think really the the main loss here came down to uh, counterplay. What counters Brigida? Um, and I I don't think there's any single character that counters Brigida except maybe Farah, maybe Widow. Um, maybe Hanzo at range. Um, ranged characters are very hard for Brigida to, uh, to fight against. Um, but Brigida requires a lot of resources to pull down. And in, so we were forced to play their game here. We attempted to outbrawl a brawl comp. We should have gotten, I don't know. Zarya Ryan, maybe. Zarya Ryan, maybe Junkrat Farah, maybe McCree, maybe maybe keep the McCree for the crowd control. May, you know, McCree may, maybe something like that, or maybe brought in Orisa Bastion. I I don't know, uh, something to pull down those shields, neutralize that Brigida, um, keep the McCree for Farah control. Uh, lose the Winston, go to D.Va to help with Farrah control. Um, something along those lines. But I, th I think it came down to comp here more than anything else. Uh, props to that Tracer. That enemy Tracer was very good at shutting down our supports, which basically also shut down our tanks because they, they just didn't have enough support to do their job. Um, and that's not the healer's fault because those tanks... We should have peeled for those for those supports. The I noticed our mercy went down a lot, especially in the first game. Um, it, it was just it was just we just didn't counter correctly. That's my opinion. Anyway, that's it for tonight. That's my tactical breakdown. Like I said, I'll do a uh, I'll do a roundup of the uh, placement matches and uh, talk about some other stuff. So, in the meantime, have a good night. Snacking out.